Hello, I'm Dr. Gary Severance with Henry Schein Dental, and I want to welcome you to Sidekick TV, where we showcase the latest in dental practice design and highlight doctors who are transforming their practice for optimal efficiency and patient care. This month, we're headed to the city that never sleeps. That's right, New York City, specifically Hudson Square in Manhattan, where we caught up with Dr. David Tarika and learned how his new dental practice, Hudson Street Dental, has already exceeded expectations in design and performance. Hudson Street Dental was a vision of myself and my partners to be in the up and coming community called Hudson Square. What attracted us to this area was Google and Disney was moving into the neighborhood and we thought it would be an excellent opportunity to mix both the residential and the commercial communities. This was uh, an old printing building and when we took over we gutted it and we designed the entire office from scratch. I've been working with uh, Ron at uh, Henry Schein for a little bit over, I don't know, 20 years. I had told him about the idea, I told him about the space, and then introduced me to a team of designers at Henry Schein. I have known Dr. Tarika for the last 28 years or so. He has been a Henry Schein customer for the last 20 of those years. And this is his first project, new build out, that he has decided to do with Henry Schein. I had an opportunity to work with someone that had an influence in uh, the restaurant industry, had done one dental office. Her company name was uh, DX3 Design, and she did a great job. And uh, some of the steps we took were to put financing in place, have a good architectural vision of what we wanted this place to look like. And that's, you know, those were the starting points for how we got the whole concept off the ground. When envisioning what Hudson Street Dental could accomplish in its new location, Dr. Tarika had two goals, both community and neighborhood focused. The goals to accomplish here is to sort of be the go-to dentist for the community, for predominantly the Google employees that are right above us. The neighborhood was really crying out for health care. There are not a lot of dentists in the community at all. This area is turning into a big tech booming area. I told him I love the idea and uh, look forward to doing his first project with Henry Schein. First impressions are everything, and that includes the design of Hudson Street Dental. With the help of his architect and designer, Dr. Tarika worked with Henry Schein's integrated design studio to piece together a modern, upscale look that carries throughout the entire practice. So with the design studio, they understood what we were trying to get accomplished very early on. And we worked with a team of designers uh, alongside with Eric Green, who facilitated what my designer and architect were trying to convey what we wanted to be. It was pretty much seamless. It took, a, it took about a month or two just going through the design phase, but I was really happy. The, the turnaround time was, was excellent. So this particular office is paperless and chartless. It has challenges if you've never worked in a paperless, chartless office, which uh, our other offices aren't. And right now, the growing pains of you know, getting comfortable in a chartless, paperless office go with the territory. But I have the team at Shine helping us, walking us through Dentrix, walking us through, getting us comfortable. As far as the technology, we have microscopes for endo. We have the a cable car cone beam, which we use for 3D imaging, for implants, for third molar impactions, for perio. The office is designed to be an experience for both the patient and the staff. So we went back and forth with a couple of different brands, you know, all of which were industry leaders. We chose ADEC in the end for its quality, for its efficiencies, for its design. It's time tested. You know, it doesn't break down. And when you do have issues with it, you know, they send a technician out and they resolve the problem. Ron, so let me take you inside and show you this new office that we just put together. Sounds good. So the concept was to work with a design team. So we came down here and we wanted to do something a little bit more downtown-y. Uh, it had a downtown feel and I think she did a great job in capturing that. So let me bring you into the Beautiful. office. 
So basically what we do, Ron, is because it's a chartless, paperless office, they sign in at home. Before they come in? Before they come in, we have an app, they sign in on the app, it populates directly to Dentrix. If they haven't done that, then they come in here, it takes about two or three minutes, they sign in, go through a medical history, a COVID questionnaire, they hit send, and that's how the process starts. This is the waiting room, and it has seating for six, and I'm gonna walk you through the office right now. This is a setup for four admins and a handicap compliant area over there. Wow. So that we're ADA completely compliant. As you can see, we've put in shields to keep people safe. We have hand sanitizers throughout the station. So let me bring you, let me bring you through the office and I'm gonna take you to the imaging area. This is the imaging area. And on this side right here, we have a multi-purpose. It's both a cone beam, which we use for soft tissue implants, sinus lifts. On this side over here is your traditional x-ray equipment. So this is the area that we capture our images and then they upload to all the offices. So once the patient finds their way into the chair, the image is already on the screen. So I'm gonna take you into an operatory. So the operatories have uh, the TV. We can watch, they can watch Netflix, they can stream whatever they have on their phone. We use it predominantly to show people a treatment plan. We go over their x-rays with them. So if the patient has questions, it's right in front of them. This is the cellar microscope that we use for endo. This room is equipped with an x-ray head. All the equipment is ADEC. All the cabinetry is ADEC. People are been raving about the chairs. I've been using I've been using ADEC chairs um, for quite some time, and I, I you know I find them to be a workhorse, and quality-wise, they're excellent. So this is the sterilization area. It was designed by ADEC, and on one side is where the dirty supplies and dirty equipment are going to come through, and as they go through, they end up on the other side. The lights indicate that they've been cleaned, that they've been sterilized, and that they're ready to come out of the autoclave. I like the color coordination. I like, I like what ADEC did to design it and the way they laid it out. Uh, it's, really, it's really clean, it's really neat. Um, the barn doors was an idea from Daniela. We like the idea of being able to close it off, and give the person a sense of privacy, but at the same time, if we have to look in and see what's going on, we can peek in and, and at a glance we can see what's happening. And the saying behind us, I think, captures what we're all about, which is that smile looks good on you. And at the beginning, I was like, oh, I don't know if I love that sign. And then she's like, trust me, it's going to work. No, it does work. And that's the nickel tour of the whole office. Ron, beautiful. thanks a lot for coming by. I really do appreciate Very it. Very beautiful. You got it. Good luck with everything. Thank you, buddy. Dr. Tarika and his team provide high quality dental care with cutting edge technology. I'm most proud of the technology incorporated in this practice. They are a Dentrix user, Demand Force user. They incorporated an endo microscope in the practice. They have an OP3D pan in the office and a TRIOS, digital impressioning in the office. Even though just open a few months, Hudson Street Dental is already seeing positive growth, great reviews, and is a welcome addition to the growing neighborhood. We opened up in last March and then we closed two days later because of the, the world unraveling with the pandemic. We just recently opened up in early April. It's growing beyond our expectations. We, we didn't anticipate that we'd be this busy so early on in the going. The way it's gonna serve the patients in the practice is many of them have said, you know, it doesn't even remind them of a dental office. And I think in general, the patients who walked out of here are really pleased with the level of service and with the comfort and the care that they're receiving. We have uh, the ability to expand uh, and add another six chairs. And as the community grows, we anticipate that in the next year or two, we'll actually expand. We'll, we'll grow the model eventually. You know, we are a full service, multidiscipline office. We'll end up having a periodontist here, an endodontist here, an oral surgeon here, and most likely a pedodontist. When asked what advice he'd give to other dentists considering building a new practice, Dr. Tarika says two things helped him most, planning and trust. You have to really spend a lot of time planning um, and you gotta do the planning on paper and you gotta bounce it off people that you trust. 
I chose Shine to do this project, um, and I am completely satisfied with the level of service, with the level of attention to detail. And I, I think when you're planning a, a project of this size and of this nature, you have to just give it a lot of thought. You know, you just can't just call up a contractor one day and say, I'm going to build a dental office. It just doesn't work that way. The city that never sleeps got a good one in Hudson Street Dental. A welcome addition to the community. And Dr. Tarika, we know you will be successful in everything you set out to do in the future. Henry Schein is honored to be part of your journey. That's a wrap for this edition of Sidekick TV. Please subscribe to the Henry Schein YouTube channel for more videos by clicking the subscribe button below. And click the bell icon to be notified of all new premieres. We hope you continue to follow us as we highlight all the exciting new practice developments and projects happening in the dental profession this year. Thank you for watching.